Hello and welcome to your new Good Power Bear tutorial. Today we're going to talk about a major section of your app, the article section. It is present in almost all apps because it allows you to display written content. It should not only be seen as a way to create a blog or a journal. It can also be used to present the services of your local business, present your school courses, etc. In short, if you want to write things for your user, this is a section for you. To create it, as usual, go to the menu My App, Content, Sections, add a section. I'll choose Blog, which corresponds to the CMS article section of Good Barber, meaning that you create your articles here directly. I name my section and add it. Once done, we'll create our articles, either by editing the content of the section here either by going to the menu My App, Content, Add. I'm in the creation page of my article. Enter my title, then my content. In addition to the text, I can add various elements. Photos, videos, quotes, AMP code. Here, I only need pictures and text. Once my article has been written, I select the section and or category to which it belongs. It can belong to several sections or category at the same time. Then the author, the date of publication. I can also pin this article at the top of my article list. The thumbnail is automatically generated from my image, but I can also change it. The summaries is displayed on some list templates, but I don't want it in mine, so I'll leave it empty. Enable or not the comments. Voila, we'll quickly edit the SEO part with the given meta and the URL of my article. I have now several options for the publication of my article. Publish, save as draft, not publish, or delay. I'll publish right away. Now, let's move on to the design. Very quickly, because I've already explained how it works in the dedicated video, in the info bar as always. Voila. Now you know how to use a blog section and how to design it. See you soon for another tutorial.